Well, for now, nothing is changing here at Whittem Field, at least for now. Today, county commissioners decided that they will continue the potential discussion for the customs office on August 5th. The idea has been circling for years. Should a customs office be added to Witham Field? Alexander Berenger says yes. We're very, very sure that this will be successful. When aircraft return to the Fairwind Air Charter hangar from outside the country, they have to pass customs in Palm Beach County or Fort Pierce. Which requires an additional step, an additional stop, burns more gas. It's a huge expense to us. And we have 25 aircraft that all do that on a, on a routine basis. He says adding customs would boost tourism dollars, but opponents fear it could mean extra cost or extra noise. Jackie Transinger is a resident of Martin County, or as she says, sometimes known as a pain in the neck. She wants things to stay as they are. And it's only for people who own airplanes, people who own large boats, and people who sell jet fuel. The $1.4 million facility would be paid for by the state's Department of Transportation and the Airport Enterprise Fund. But a group of aviation and marine businesses will provide $50,000 for the first three years, just in case there's a shortfall. Oh. Both sides have to wait. The majority of county commissioners said they didn't have enough time today to vote on the issue. Yeah, keep it quiet or I will put you out. The chairman of the Chamber of Commerce says the delay is typical of Martin County commissioners. Now they're claiming they haven't read their reports already. What are they doing here in a meeting if they have done their homework. Estimates suggest three to five thousand additional aircraft would come through this airport in an average year if this were approved. Right now, it's about seventy thousand aircraft per year, and before the recession, it was actually one hundred twenty thousand aircraft every year. Live here in Stewart, Ashley Walters, WPTV News Channel Five.